The Wyoming Department of State Parks and Cultural Resources is committed to enriching the lives of Wyoming residents and visitors through outdoor opportunities and cultural events. With a cumulative economic impact of $469 million and supporting over 3,800 jobs across the state, our department is increasing visitation to and improving the experiences of those who live in and visit the Cowboy State. In 2017, the agency hosted over 300,000 visitors during the total solar eclipse in many of our 13 state parks and 25 historic sites. Some of these sites also hosted the first Adventure Racing World Championships held in the U.S. that same year. The Department of Wyoming State Parks continues to enhance and create outdoor experiences by increasing the ways our parks can be used, from adding new facilities such as yurts and stargazing sites to concessionaire equipment rentals for paddle boards and ATVs. Wyoming State Parks proudly sponsors special events across the state designed to encourage active lifestyles and outdoor education. From the Capitol Camp Out, which teaches people how to camp, to the Summer Outdoor Slam designed to showcase different things people can enjoy in the outdoors. Part of the State Parks Agency includes the Wyoming Trails Program, which groomed over 66,000 miles of snowmobile and cross-country trails in the past two years across the state, and saw a 4.49% increase in snowmobile use during that time. In 2018, Wyoming State Parks formed the Wyoming Outdoor Recreation Office, which has already developed four proposals to encourage outdoor recreation businesses to relocate to Wyoming. This new office also assisted with the 2018 Governor's Magpul shooting match. On the cultural resources side of the organization, the State Historic Preservation Office saw the addition of two new National Historic Landmarks, Ames Monument between Laramie and Cheyenne, and the Hell Gap Paleo-Indian site, where archaeologists continue to explore our state's history. The State Historic Preservation Office also began Preservation 101 training to help educate Wyomingites in the preservation of our state's historic structures. Each summer, the Historic Preservation Office celebrates the annual Centennial Farm and Ranch Awards to remember and honor our agricultural heritage. The Office of the Wyoming State Archaeologist, which is also part of Cultural Resources, oversaw 23 archaeological excavations into Wyoming's past during the past two years and submitted just under 30,000 artifacts for preservation. Each year, it continues to host the Wyoming State Archaeology Fair in Laramie, designed to teach about Wyoming's prehistory and to increase interest in the field of archaeology in younger generations. Also part of the Department of Cultural Resources is the Wyoming Arts Council, which granted over $700,000 across the state to communities, nonprofits, and individual artists to create and share art with all of our state's residents. The Arts Council also brought concerts to communities of all sizes, gave fellowships to writers and artists, and fostered the placement of arts in public buildings. To preserve and continue Wyoming traditions, the Arts Council gives grants to folk and traditional artists, specifically to pass their knowledge and skills on to the next generation of Wyoming residents. In 2017, the Arts Council also held a symposium to encourage the professional development of artists. The Wyoming State Archives and Wyoming State Museum in Cheyenne also contribute to the missions of cultural resources. The State Archives holds everything from prison records to birth certificates. In addition to helping government agencies and county clerks, it helped over 4,000 private researchers from 32 states find important documents in the past two years. The agency also digitized over 1,000 boxes of records, freeing up space and providing ease of access to all interested parties. The Wyoming State Museum preserves and exhibits artifacts important to Wyoming's history and culture. It also offers lectures and in-person programming to youth and adults about Wyoming's past. Over 400,000 students have participated in the museum's educational programs. The staff has also given over 200 Skype tours of the museum to over 7,000 students in 41 states and 23 countries, sharing Wyoming's story with the rest of the world. Finally, the Wyoming Cultural Trust Fund administers grants for arts and culture. In 2018, their grant awards reached over 20 communities across the state, bringing concerts, lectures, and other events to all parts of our state. Over the next fiscal year, the Wyoming Department of State Parks and Cultural Resources will continue to seek new ways to improve communities and enrich lives in our state, thanks to your support.